So you see, you see, long nails like you and Hannah. And oh, well, see, yeah. Very Freddy Kruegerish. Oh, yeah. some guys like that though. They don't it care about the Freddy Krueger. Oh, I'm sure it's they do. It's so weird. I'm it's like, are you sure? sure? You, no, I know a lot you gotta of massage the area and just like get it pretend all biting. Pretend or something. Pretend. You know, knuckle them a little bit. Well, they they really think that like this is like your whole finger. Yeah. Like no. This is this is woman talk. This is like a view. We got a long way to go. Wow. So 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 is that your experience? You just. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's just like you're gonna hurt yourself. And then one time I was like, "All right, boy," and then he never asked me to do it again. No, he got he got his. He got it. I bet he did. Yeah, he did. It was recently. Um. Yeah. What is I this? What is the timeline matter? I don't know. Yeah, how recently was this? Uh, forget the ministry album. Let, let's hear about the hand and second to freaking up guys' asses. No, let's go feel it right in ministry. Let's talk about Hannah right now. Yeah. <laughs> now, well, you were talking about how Ray's ministry is in concert, and mm-hmm. you saw my concert. Worst segue I've ever fucking done. So, <laughs> yes, we'll from her, back. her finger up the ass. So you saw them, and I know how much you love rap music. Uh, Interesting opening acts because you had the Death Grips, which are a rap group that open up for you. Sort of, yeah. They're I industrial, yeah. Yeah, yeah they're I've industrial. Did you like I them? I missed the Death Grips because my we were because you hate rap. No, we were getting drunk in the that Uber, and then we just made it. They're very we like drunk industrial. In the Uber. Actually, yeah, we brought it. We always bring our beers in the Uber. We kind of sneak it in, and we go in back. Nice. And, this is this is why style. this is why I bring it up. This is why I bring it up because I've never heard of Death Grips. I never heard Chelsea Wolf, and because they open open for you, I check them both out, and they're great. Especially Chelsea Wolf's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys love Chelsea Wolf? No. Check her out. She's really good. <laughs> All right, I will. She's yeah. really good. So they're opening. I was like, they're opening up for ministry. I was like, well, and then I, I check them out. But so the new album is causing a lot of controversy. The new oh. album is called Shocker. Um, Ameri- Americant with a KKK in the middle. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, sorry, so, like, so, oh. sorry about that, Ophelia. Ophelia's Jewish. Is, Hannah, are you Jewish? What? Are you Jewish? No. Okay, Ophelia's Jewish. So. My aunt. So I'm the only one offended because I'm Jewish. <laughs> well, what do you mean? My, my aunt's Jewish. <laughs> Okay, no. so that, that's she might be offended. So wait, what, so wait, is no. it your mom? Is it your mom? No, um, through marriage. Through, no, she's oh, super okay. cool. She doesn't practice or anything. Yeah. Anyway, anyway, before we start, well, well, before we start a bris, um, so the uh, no, but obviously it's satirical. But the uh, the, the the single Antifa has caused that was the a, first single. Yeah. Antifa. Yeah. Antifa. <laughs> explain explain to Ophelia what Antifa is. Well, you know what, you know what it is. As Antifa? Yeah, Antifa. Did I just yes, announce it? Uh, yes, yeah. actually, funny story, real quick. Um, I just did an IR scene. I played an Antifa, like, privileged white girl. Okay. And I, <laughs> I pronounce it Antifa, but that, that could have been our, could've, you could have done our video. I just got destroyed by this, like, uh, it was Rico Strong, which is a very, very large and well-endowed black man. What was He's it? like, do you really, do you really think Black Lives Matter, and I'm just getting choked out by, like, this giant penis well, I thought, I thought, I thought, I thought, saying <laughs> fuck Trump and, like, I love black dick. Well, oh, I thought, I thought black I thought Lives Matter. <laughs> I thought I was dressed like Ben Carson. I didn't know what was going on there, but it uh, <laughs> sounds more interesting than the video we really did. Anyway, so, so, so how do you pronounce that again? Antifa? Antifa, excuse me. Ant- Antifa? I, yeah, you say tomato, I say tomato. Antifa. But that was, you know, that was, mm-hmm. I mean, that single came out, like, now it seems old to me. I mean, right, but uh, you, uh, you've obviously seen... We played that at... Um, yeah, you did. You had the Trump chicken. Shit. Yeah, yeah. I have we a big guy picture by them. Like. We did that at Blackest, I think, as well, that song. Like, that song was written... Fuck, I wrote... That was the last song, I, musically, that I wrote for that record. Right. And um, in November of 2016, I think. Right. So the record's so, older than me now. The, 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 re- the, reason, the reason I uh, bring it up is because I'm sure you've seen... I didn't know there, was that, there were that many Republican ministry fans, but <coughs> apparently there are. Uh, and if you go and when, if you go on Blabbermouth and Loudwire and all... I don't. Is it so bad to be Republican? I don't. I'm not saying it's bad to be Republican. It's, it's bad so to bad. say... <laughs> it's, bad to, it's bad to start... Uh, it's, I don't know what the, if they've, they've never heard a ministry album in, in, in their life, but obviously uh, Al is liberal-leaning. I would say that's clear. Yeah. You know. So what do you expect? But everybody's like, "Fuck this guy!" Fuck, you know. Yeah. You know what? People, you know, people have become so touchy feely. Like it's like. Well, that's the other thing. Is it's now you can't say any anything. fucking thing at right. all because if it's, somebody's getting fucking offended. It's all college offended, fucking safe space. You know? Yeah. So, but that's nothing new to us. I mean, every fucking record we do. I mean, before when it was the last sucker, it was the Bush thing. When. It, it, we always get really there were people that were like oh, fuck yeah man I didn't think anybody was defending Bush oh, dude we were like we were getting so much shit for the for the the Bush record it's called the Bush trilogy right it was three records that we did and 
Yeah, it's the same thing for us, man. It's just nowadays it just seems like it's so much more because everyone is so fucking sensitive about everything. Everything. Uh, and and everything. social media, too. They're yeah. Expect- yeah, yeah, like exactly. if you, if you post exactly. one bad thing on Twitter, exactly. yeah. you know, you just get bashed yeah. and slandered. Yeah. It's like, yeah. how, do you, how do you people have time to yeah. even, like, delve this hard so into it's, somebody? So, instead of, so it's like, okay, here's the new ministry song. So instead of saying, okay, it's good or it's bad, it's like, these liberal fuckwads and all this other shit. So what do you guys? I mean, what do you? Yeah. What but do you, but, there, but you know what? There's always going to be that that sort of uh, section of people. Right. So you're always going to do that. And then the, you know the the others that that love it or hate it or whatever. But there, it's always going to be like that, man. We always get that shit. For right. Every fucking record we do. Right. And uh, and what I'm excited about this tour because it, it's a really an all star band. Uh, because of me. Well, because <laughs> of you. <laughs> because of Al. But. Uh, you've had Tony Campbell. So no, is what he said. Exactly. You've had, <laughs> yes, Basically. and because, well, you've never hooked me up, that's one thing, but oh. that's all right. Oh. With what? Look, you've like got a ticket. A ticket? Oh, please. Brooklyn Bowl, Vegas, we're gone, right, Ophelia? That's you got to hook us up? Yeah, I can get you into Vegas. Okay, we'll do listen, that. I, listen, <laughs> I'm, kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Right. <laughs> Fucking L.A. is the worst place for me. Right. Oh yeah, because you live band. here. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I'm one of those people that just stands outside the venue, and I've like done they that. can, they, like, I can just hear my it. My family <laughs> is here. My, you know, I grew up here in LA, right? So, right. And most of the industry is here. All, you know, most of the companies that endorse us and shit like that. So everybody fucking wants to get on the list. Yeah, you'll go, you'll go on Facebook you know, say I can't get you on the list. I'm just like, look, I fucking can't. I just, it's impossible. <laughs> you like, bought, she bought her ticket. I bought my ticket. She, she bought her motherfucking ticket. She's medicate. fucking rad. Um, <laughs> here's the thing. Um, I love hooking up my friends every every chance I get, and right. and I tell them, listen, if I'm able to do something, I do it. Like people don't even have to ask me. Like I just do it on my own. But L.A., New York is tough, and Chicago, right. those, those are the toughest places for us. And keep in mind, we've got, like, there's six of us in the band. Right. We, we're usually allotted about two or three guests per band. Of course. That's yeah. it? Yeah. Wow. Think about that. Yeah, Think no, about, I know. So, you know, when people are like, and what kills me so you is... you got to make is, money is, somehow, you know? Exactly. you got to make money. What kills me is, is, is hearing from people that I never hear from. Right. Until they know I'm in their town, right. and then all of a sudden, hey, hey, buddy, how you doing? You know, is everything going cool? Oh, hey, by the way, I saw that you're you're gonna be in town. It's that kind of shit totally that fucking list. irritates me. You know, it's that kind of shit that. Well, and then it also the it sucks sometimes because like I run events and everything. They're like, oh well, I know you. I'm like, yeah, but this is like a hundred and fifty dollar event yeah. right. to yeah. show up to, and it's but you and then and then people start being very cold to you. They're right. like, right. Mm-hmm. it's like I'm not trying. I and then, Sorry. and then you're an asshole. And then I'm a and dick. And then all of a sudden you're an asshole. It's like, exactly. what have you done for me lately? Yeah, like, like what? what they have. But anyway, uh, I digress. Back to I, back to the Brooklyn Bowl, yeah. Yeah, no, 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 I, I was kidding. I, I was kidding. Although I did. Like, yeah, can I get some fans dig it? Although, although for me although, and four friends, although, although, they're really hot. Although I did get you in for the Dark Mark record release party a couple years ago. Oh. Party. But uh, the what? Remember at the CIA? The what? Wow. The CIA. <laughs> I had a record release party at the CIA at Society One played and uh, and uh, remember that? Anyway, no. Okay. Uh oh. So you got it free. So anyway, but the, what I was saying is You were there, just don't worry uh, about Tony, it. Tony 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 Campos from Static yeah. X is the bass player, has been for a long time. Yeah. How's how's he? He's great. I've known Tony for over twenty years. Yeah. We used to do fuck right up the street. We used to play the coconut yeah. teaser. Together. Used to fuck right up the street. <laughs> yeah. At the Where? coconut teaser. Right at the coconut teaser. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. We've been you and Tony, for over Jesus Christ, years. yeah. Mm. Yeah. With your hair and his beard, holy shit, yeah. I can just imagine. Yeah. Exactly. But uh, that's a possibility. Right. <laughs> but uh, but that's not all. Uh, <laughs> it's more. There's more. <laughs> Joey Jordison, formerly of Slipknot, is on the drums. Yep. Joey played for us in 2006. Okay. So he's he's already been. Was he the clown? Uh, which one is he? The, like Ronald McDonald? No, no. Like which which mask was he? Slipknot. Oh, I don't know. So I've never. It's like, I've never it's really like a. I, he'll get. It's like a like a that gold. Did he have the pin pen? mask thing? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, kind of plain. All right. Like, yeah, I, I think, remember that. I think. Yeah. And how's he as a drummer? He's great. He's yeah. one of the best. Because yeah. Ministry had two drummers at one time. Yeah. He can handle it by himself. Yeah, I mean we've had single drummers for for many years. Right. So yeah, he's but, great. He's an amazing drummer. But that's not all. And there's he, more. There's more. You're gonna, you're gonna love this. DJ Swamp is playing with DJ you. DJ Swamp is fucking killer. Well, you saw Swamp already. 
And just so you know who DJ Swamp is, you know that Crystal Method song, that's the name of the game with the yeah. scratch? That's, that's, that's Swamp. He, he no was scratching. Shit. That's Swamp. He, that's he, the name he's of the game. That, he's on that entire album, by the way. Yes. He's on that entire Crystal Method record.